Happy New Year, Kings and Queens. This is episode nine of Talk About It Tuesdays. Talk About It Tuesdays. Talk About It Tuesdays. Holla at your queen. All right. So, hello. Happy New Year, everybody. Um, I didn't do a Talk About It Tuesday on Christmas Eve and New Year's Eve. Had a lot going on. It was the holiday season, but I did do a lot of other um, collaborations and videos. So check out my channel, you all. How are you all this New Year's? I'm feeling pumped, feeling good. Y'all know I'm feeling good. Let's talk about it Tuesdays. Please forgive me, it's cold in, out here. Let me put back on my hood. Okay, so I have a few new subscribers. I thank you all, I love you all. You know, slowly it's growing. They say things take time. I'm hanging in there. I'm hanging in there, I thank you all. So if you are new to talk about it Tuesdays, basically these episodes take place in my car. You all know in the other videos I get real deep informational. You know, we speak on psychology, background, science, things that I did in science. Um, we talk about life. My main goal on this channel is ways to keep us happy and how to be happy. Things that has helped me over the years, having you all come on my journey with me. But on Talk About It Tuesdays, talk about it Tuesdays is light and airy we have current events we talk about whatever we want to talk about you know I have something for everybody some people only watch this some people don't watch this so if you resonate with this please watch it I upload a video every Tuesday so for today let's get into it and let's knock out the current events first so for the current event here we go President Trump talking about world world three you all know i really don't follow him as much you know because i don't agree with a lot of the things that he say but he is still um you know um a public figure our president so i need to be aware of some of the things that's going on um a lot of people have been talking to me about this and um, i'm gonna say this remember the serenity prayer yeah, I can't control the World War III, but what I do know, a law of the land, whatever we focus on grows. So do I want to get my focus and put that on World War III? No. So I'm not focusing on that. I am not focusing on that at all, you all. It's just not something I want to focus on because it's going to make me upset. You know, it's going to get me depressed, a little down, and I want to be happy. I want to focus on things that's going to bring joy and love to my life. All right? So as it go on, you all keep keeping me informed on it. That's all I'm going to talk about, about that World War Three thing. You know, I don't, it's not, um, I can't do nothing about it. But what I can do is focus less on it. Because the less I focus on it, the less we all focus on it, the less likely it will be let's talk about it next thing okay so I've been following a lot with the health care stuff in Michigan we have a new law it started on um, 1 120 it just started recently so a lot of health care and health insurances will be changing you are so make sure you're looking at your plan it's a lot of stipulations a lot of regulations a lot of things you have to do with healthcare through your companies and also through state healthcare. So, like I said last year, 2020 is about to be some major changes. I'm gonna go into a real deep video. Hopefully it'll be up next week. You know, cause there's a lot to it that we need to be aware and cognizant of because we are gonna have to do some things to keep ourselves going as well. And I'll upload that soon. But, um, if you haven't been to the doctor, you have something going on, or you just haven't got yourself checked out, now is the time to do it. Because a lot is changing with this healthcare. What do I mean by a lot of changing? Some healthcare is gonna be taken away, some programs are gonna be taken away, some specialty things you need will be taken away. So get on that. I am on it, you all. I even set up my I set up my therapy appointment last year. I had a um, video last year about grief, you know, dealing with my mom's death. 
So check that out, how to deal with grief. That video I have, I did in the summertime. Just scroll down, it's on there, how to deal with grief. I think I had on some red glasses in that video. And I told you all in that video in the summertime that, you know, just because I went to school for psychology where I helped out and I worked with kids with different um, ailments and mental disorders and different things don't mean anything because I am not a grief counselor. You know, that is not my specialty. So I said, I need some help too. So when I say I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do it. I might not do it right away, but I got on it. And then I had to cancel the appointment. And then the secretary called and she had to reschedule because the um, the counselor wasn't gonna be in or whatever. So over the months, it's been going and going, but guess what? Your girl just went the other day. Hey, talk about it Tuesdays. Talk about it Tuesdays. Holla at your queen. Remember, take care of your mental health as well. Because if you don't take care of this, this controls everything else. Get this together. All right? So I had a very good, you know, my first session went very well. You know, I like the lady that I have. You know, I think we're going to be making some great strides. But remember, you all, take care of yourself. You only got one body, one mind, one life. And how you going to help somebody else if you can't help yourself? I love you all. All right? And that's it for current events. So let's jump into something else. Something light, airy, and fluffy. 2020, what is your resolutions? What is your goals? Are you going to set any goals? Are you just going to do? For me, I'm not going strictly on resolutions and goals. I learned over the years, you can say something, put it out there, but action is really where it's going to go into the forefront. So this year is all about action. I have some things that I want to do that I want to accomplish by the end of 2020, and I feel strongly in my heart I would do it. I already started taking the action. Actually, I started two weeks, <coughs> excuse me, I started two weeks prior to the new year. So I love y'all. Let's pray for each other, you know. Let's share this knowledge, sharing this caring, healing come through testimony. That's why I do these videos. Remember, when you are public out here, putting yourself out here publicly, you got to have some thick skin because everybody not going to like what you say. And everybody is, some people will love what you say, some people not going to like what you say. But bump them, what do you think about yourself? And hey, if you helping somebody else, that's good enough for me. I love you all, kings and queens. Have a beautiful day and enjoy this beautiful life we are given. Love is the main key. Subscribe, share, like, and comment, and enjoy your day. Mwah.